safe and sporting events going on in Anne Arundel County started tonight. WMER 2 News Ashley McDowell went to Glen Burnie to check out the reaction. Ashley. That's right, Kelly and Jamie. Um, I went to Glen Burnie versus South River High School football game tonight to see how parents feel about the new regulations for sporting and extracurricular activities, and it seems they are on board. School is back in session, and you know what that means. High school football. It's a time for yelling, cheering, tackling, and touchdowns. But sometimes fans can take it too far. Anne Arundel County Superintendent Mark Bedell sent a letter out to families stating after some disruptions in the first couple of weeks, there will be new rules when it comes to sporting events in hopes of eliminating disruptive or violent behavior. Football and athletics are, are great parts of our educational system here in Anne Arundel County. And as you see here, you know, people turning out to watch this and they deserve to be able to do that in an environment that's free of worrying about their safety. New regulations go into effect today. Now, when fans or students engage in violent behavior, they will be removed and suspended from extracurricular activities for 90 days. Youngsters must be accompanied by adults, and even student athletes caught in such behavior will face consequences. We're all coming here for peace to support the football team, and I think it shouldn't be any violence. Anything like that, they need to leave home. Some parents say they haven't seen any violent disruptions at football games and already feel safe. I haven't seen one at Spalding or here. I'm in the fans all the time cheering, saying who kid is that, whose grandson is that, and having fun in the stand. And most of the stand people have fun. They have so many school resource officers. There's at least three here today. They've got officers at the gate. So they have the sides are separated, the different so it's it seems safe. We've never had an issue. This is our second year of high school football with my high schooler. Others say the new restrictions will be good for the younger crowd. Well, I like the fact that the uh, middle school kids and elementary school kids have to have a parent come in with them. Um, we've been hearing rumors that the middle school kids are uh, causing a little bit of issues, but it's good to have a little bit of more parents in the stands. Bedell says there will be a zero tolerance policy that attendance to these activities is a privilege, not a right. <laughs> Superintendent Bedell says he will continue to take the appropriate steps to make sure those types of extracurricular activities remain safe, even if that means changing the time and date of events or limiting attendance. Back to you guys.